What's up guys? Welcome back to the YouTube channel. It's Friday. It's race day. We're doing front side, no prep. Well, it's actually front side light prep. More like bra bracket prep is what I would call it. More like we're doing that today. We're at Knoxville Dragway. It's the day before Turbo John's backwards brawl. So you can see we're, we're a little sweaty. Happy wasn't sweating earlier, but he's sweating now. It's getting hot. We were down at the beginning of the track. We went Facebook Live a few minutes ago. But here we go, guys. We're gonna do some more testing today. We made a pass yesterday and the car was not very fast. Uh, it was breaking up real bad on the beginning. So we're gonna pull the plugs off of it, check the spark plug wires. Hopefully it just needs some spark plugs. I mean, this thing is, I hadn't changed spark plugs in a while. So with us not changing spark plugs for a while, you know, it's one of those things, sometimes it'll it'll get to going, it'll break up. It kind of looked like it was on a, a traction control rev limiter, but it was not. So uh, here we go, let's see what we got. Let's see what we can find. Make sure, hopefully we ain't got no dead holes from uh, any problems. We need to pull valve covers off of it real fast and look at the valves and then we will be set. Let's check it out. All right, guys, don't forget, go to turbojohnracing.com, grab yourself some merchandise, comment, like, and subscribe, and hopefully, I will see y'all here at Knoxville Dragway for the Backwards Brawl from the top end of the track, Saturday, July 9th. All right, guys, well, we're pulling the spark plugs out of this thing. I got my side out, and they are, that is not what a turbo spark plug is supposed to look like, especially on methanol. Uh, it is, they are beat up. That's the, that is the life of, now we might have a problem with this one. Now, wait a minute, there's a gap there. But you see how crooked that is? It could be, maybe it was crooked when we gapped it and I just didn't pay no attention to it. I won't focus now. It's a little off. It looks like it. No, it's, no, it is freaking crooked. No, it's about. I don't know. Maybe it got bent when we when we gapped it. We gapped these things tight at like fifteen thousand. So it could have been. Oh yeah, they're all like that. So uh, we're changing the plugs. We should have done this a long time ago. All right, guys. So like I said, these plugs. One of my problems. Is I run number 10s on this low, this is low boost on the back of the track stuff. I probably should be running number 9s. Uh, maybe even number 8s to help keep themselves clean. But I've got a set of number 10s, so we're going to put those in there. That's what it's supposed to look like. That's what it looks like after... Shoot, I don't even remember last time we changed it. Alright guys, so we had a little bit of a rainstorm come through. Uh, so it is mostly gone, it looks like. So they're starting to dry the track. They're going to broom it off, get all the puddles off of it. And we're still going to do some testing tonight, hopefully. Uh, our car is ready. So it's just a matter of getting the track dry. So here we go. That's what they're working on. All right, guys. So the track is almost dry. So they're dragging the, the tire. They've got the machines out. The track is almost dry. It's coming around pretty good. Probably another 15, 20 minutes. It'll be it'll be dried out pretty good. Uh, there is some, some rain in still. It's hard to tell, man. When you look at the radar, it looks like uh, this is north out this way, so it looks like there is some, but it looks like it's going mostly to the east, so it may not get us, but at the same time, you can see kind of, that's a pretty view of the mountain, but I mean, it's just hard, it's hard to tell. Uh, there are starting to be some people uh, coming in now, uh, getting ready for tomorrow, so that's still our game plan at the moment. All right, guys, well, they got the track dry, but Kelly, what's happening? Just started raining again <laughs> it just started sprinkling again but i'm shocked at how fast they got that track dry i mean there was yeah, down and down I mean, we should have showed it Did you see I, I, yeah i took some video as they were drying it puddles down there and they got this entire track dry in what under an hour yeah it's probably an hour or so. they're like experts at track drying so i mean you know i guess it's they're again living in tennessee the clouds coming over to the mountains there and it's just sprinkling but it's gonna probably be a little little too much to overcome tonight i don't know i mean it looks like when you look at the radar, the old tire, that's what we used to do back in the day. And that actually works really good. It, I mean, it creates, it's got a lot of surface area. It creates a lot of heat. It creates a lot of, you know, friction. So, and you can hear the tire starting to squeal. It was squealing. Man, it was almost race ready for sure. So, uh, Probably, I don't know, we're gonna to get to race tonight. We'll see what the weather does. We'll see what it holds off. Yeah, yeah, it's, it smokes it when it, as it gets dry. Um, track prep. There'll be some people going, oh, you can't, no prep, you can't, you can't drag a track. <laughs> that's prepping, that's prepping the track. I think drying is not the same 
dragging it and dry that's right that's right dry dragging for the purpose of removing water is not prepping it's it's making, it's making it, so it, you can it's, it's making it so you can race that's right so uh i don't know uh we got some work to do to the car we got the spark plugs changed uh we do need to change the back springs you're gonna do that tomorrow morning kelly uh, yeah, I got that on my list. Okay, okay. Kelly's gonna be doing the change, sure. the, the springs tomorrow. I know how to do, that. do you know? Do you know what? What, what rate are we gonna go to? Four. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. So, so springs are rated in pounds per inch. So let me explain. Four pounds per inch. No. So if, if you have a hundred and ten pound spring, a hundred and ten pounds will compress it one inch. So we have a lot of weight in the back of the car. So what does that mean? We need to do. Ding, 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 ding. We need to put a heavier <laughs> spring on it to hold it up. I was look, right. I was right. <laughs> okay, look, I shouldn't be messing with Kelly. Look, she, she's doing a good job. She's down here. We're fixing to eat supper. Yeah, I just made you dinner and lemonade. I know, right? It and was good too. Was real, I hadn't had any banana pudding yet. No. I'm fixing to have some. I'm yeah, fixing to have some I got banana a whole pudding. Tub for everybody to have some. Go check out Kelly's channel, The Drag Racer's Wife. She is. Have you done a video yet on her trip? Or no, you've just been compiling just videos. Shorts, I think. Okay. Shorts. Yeah, she's done a couple of shorts, and uh, we did get some Bojangles sweet tea, so that's a good thing. Yeah, and I got a new track, uh, it's a track cuisine, um, <laughs> pit cuisine. Oh, pit cuisine. Started. I got a new pit cuisine coming up in this next video, yeah. Nice, so, nice, nice. Well, we're going to see how it goes. So, uh, I mean, I don't know. This is, we got to, we got to pack the parachute, change the springs. We put the, the new spark plugs in. We have not cranked it up, but I think... That was our problem. I showed y'all the spark plugs. I mean, those things were beat up. It's been, they've been in there for a long time. It's just one of those things. I should have probably changed the spark plugs probably several outings ago. Um, we'll run a hotter plug next time too. I put 10s back in it. With the exception of hole number one, I think it is, has a number 11 plug because I did not have a whole set of number 10s. So I'm gonna have to monitor that hole uh, because you know, the, the hotter the plug, the more it keeps itself clean. And the colder the plug, the more chance it has to foul out. So that could be a problem. So we'll see, I don't know. But uh, right now our plan, we're still shooting to have everything happen on Saturday. But we'll keep y'all informed, I'll let you know. And then we can decide what's going to happen. But like I said guys, we're racing this weekend. Racing is happening. Sunday is looking beautiful for weather. So Sunday is not gonna be a problem at all. So we'll see what happens. All right, guys, comment, like, and subscribe. Hope to see y'all this weekend. Later. All right, guys, so now the, I've said the rain word, and it's gone. So now there is no rain. <laughs> but it's, man, what are we going to do, guys? What are we going to do? What are we going to do? What are we going to do? Let's go. Burnout. Yeah. Hey, drifting. Drifting would work. Hey, I've got, got a, really there's a figure, car. look at the figure eight. Yeah. Oh yeah, we can do figure eight racing. That, that used to happen out here. Smart car. <laughs> hey, we can have a rental car race. Yeah, rental car race. I wonder if Kelly and them are eating yet. Kelly went up there to find out about, are, are they really? Yeah, they're eating she, she didn't even tell me. All right, I'm going to get food.